All right, well, the weather may be getting colder, but there's still plenty going on at the Minnesota Zoo. Donnie Crook from the Zoomobile team is here with Holly. Tell, Donnie, great to have you here. Yes. Uh, tell us about Holly. Holly is a yellow naped Amazon parrot. Can you say hello? Hi. Good job. Oh. <laughs> wow, that's impressive. She is part of our Zoomobile program, so she goes to schools, to libraries, to lots of different places to teach uh, kids about these amazingly cool animals. They come from Central and South America, and they are very, very vocal. Um, Hi. What do you say to a baby? <laughs> What else? Good. <laughs> <laughs> what's the uh, what's the vocabulary like here? Uh, how many words? Can she um, get? These ones don't have as big a vocabulary as some other parrots, but um, she does have a wide variety. She is really, really. Um, she really likes people when they are nice and clean and healthy. So Holly hates it when I pick my nose. <laughs> Nothing. What are you doing? Oh my gosh! Wow. Uh, Holly, fantastic. what do you think about that? It's good. <laughs> Good material. I would like to have Holly around with me all the time to laugh at my jokes. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, that's a very good uh, boost for my ego. Can you whistle? <laughs> Holly, can you whistle? <laughs> that's not right. Hold on for one second. <laughs> Holly, can you whistle? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Got to be careful with that kind of whistle. Yes, these days. Yeah, that's yeah, going to get true. you in trouble yep. there, Holly. <laughs> sure can. Yep. All right, uh, we've got Give to the Max coming up here. You guys have a surprise announcement? We do. I don't even know what it is. But oh. um, during uh, Give to the Max Day, we are going to have some live. Uh, um, Presentations. We're going to have some live feeds and other stuff like that, so that at the end of those, we are going to have a surprise announcement. And I don't even know what that is. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll find out. And give it the next day. Uh, yes. Adult night out has been a very popular thing you guys have done at the zoo. It's a chance to explore the zoo without the kids. Right? It is. A lot of people tell us that they want to explore the zoo just as an adult. So they come. They can uh, from 4:30 to 7, I believe, and they will come and uh, see all the inside parts of the zoo without mm -hmm. all the kids running around. They can enjoy some music. They can enjoy some other. Other stuff like that too. If they just want to sit in front of one of the exhibits and just sit and relax, they can yeah. do that. All right, I know this is mainly for kids, but like, does she know any dirty words? She doesn't. She uh, doesn't. Nope. She's lived really? at the whole the zoo her really? whole entire life, so she doesn't know Come any on, dirty Daddy. words. No, she doesn't. We know you <laughs> have like some backstage <laughs> tricks that we, you do. We don't. We try and keep it clean because we don't uh, want those coming out uh, accidentally yeah, right. on a program uh, in front of kindergartners. Yeah, that's fair. fair yep. That'd be that's awkward. responsible, <laughs> Donnie. Fine. That's the YouTube video nobody <laughs> wants posted. Right? <laughs> Minnesota Zoo's Adult Night Out is Thursday, November 9th from 4.30 to 7.30 p.m. You can go to WCCO.com slash links for tickets. And if you have kids, you just put them in a locker at the zoo, right? <laughs> that, that's how it works. Two bucks, you get that yeah, back at the end. Yeah, it's fine. Thanks, Daddy. Thanks, Thank Holly.